Okay hey guys, have a video for you today on a new knife I just got. Um, this is, is, I guess, a review of it. Um, I just got it today, so I don't really have a lot of experience with it. But, we'll get started. As you can tell, it is a Victorinox. Um, I got this jeweler's loop here. I don't think I've showed it to you yet. Um, I'll just show you how good it works. Looks good. Yeah. Without it. With it. Yeah. You get the point. Anyway, this is my Victorinox Classic. It has a the file screwdriver. Yeah, file flathead thing. Blade. Scissors. And then it's got your toothpick and um, your where your tweezers go but I'm missing my tweezers so I gotta find them um there's that one the new one is in this box so just hang tight for a second I actually don't know which model this is I think it's a secretary I'm not sure about that um this I will show you um you can see it is Victorinox see if I can bring you close on this on the blade yep Victorinox Victorinox Switzerland um I actually got this when I was in Boy Scouts back in the day probably too scratched there you go Actually, I've never looked at that before. Let's see if I need to focus. Yeah, you just see the Boy Scouts, Cub Scouts, whatever it was. Yeah, Cub Scouts symbol. Anyway, um, in this box, you see it's Victorinox. I actually didn't buy this from the store. I got it at Goodwill. Yes, you heard me, Goodwill. Um. I saw the Victorinox box, it instantly, as soon as I got over to the case, it caught my eye. Um, and this is the model I got. Might be able to make that out. I'm going to bring your signature to light. And it just has the serial number, I guess. Um, so, move these aside. Th that was just a video, a short thing on my just to, as comparison knives well anyway you have your the taper they give you showing you how to change the battery just use the paper clip um just some information on it good to keep um and pop the knife out here see um there's hardly any damage to it. The only thing I've noticed is them scratches. I mean, that's it. It was like in perfect condition. It's still got some finger marks on it. Wipe them off. And close here. There you go, Victorinox, Switzerland. Stainless steel or something. Yeah. Um, and here are the tools it has. It has your blade, which is the same size as the oh, the classics blade, I believe. Yes, same size. It's actually the same length, um, but it is thicker, <laughs> much thicker. It's like two of these. Um, and then it has your screwdriver slash nail cleaner slash file tool and then it has scissors on the back and I I searched it on YouTube and only found like two videos on it um, but cool thing is here hold on a second I'll show you well I'll have to show you this first if you push down on this logo 
Sorry if you can hear my dogs in the background. Anyway, push down on it. You'll see light. It's not the brightest red LED in the world, but I mean, it's it's all right. Um, it could definitely be a lot better, but it's there. And you're probably looking at this hole right there, wondering what in the world's in that. Well, if you look on the side, one of the coolest features, I think, in my opinion on this knife, slide that forward, and out comes a pin. Um, and something to write on, this will work. Blue ink. Um, it writes really smooth. Um, all you have to do to retract that is push this over and back. You can see it has this little jimping on the back of that just to give you grip. Um, yeah, it's got a little um, split ring uh, attached to your keys or your gear, however you're planning on carrying it. Um, yeah, um, it's pretty cool. I'll open it up here, give you a comparison. So we have the secretary, not secretary, um, signature, classic secretary. I believe it's a secretary. Um, comment if you, if I'm wrong, or if I'm right, just tell me. Um, so, yeah, that's about all there is to talk about it. Um, I don't know the blade steel or anything. Uh, I searched, I looked around a little bit, and I'm sure you could get them cheaper, get them more. Uh, I found these around 20, 25. Um, it sounded a little high to me, but, I mean, it is what it is. But I got it at Goodwill for two bucks. Yeah, two bucks. Um, I was just stunned um, that I could find one that was in really good condition for that cheap at Goodwill. So that's that. Uh, thank you for watching. And I will talk to you guys later. See ya.